The Greytech Power Pack 2021 for Advanced Deal has now been released. The Power Pack is Greytech's extension to Advanced Deal, which gives users more modeling tools, connections, templates, sections, and data. This video will run through what's new in the 2021 release. The first change you will notice is the Power Pack ribbon has been reorganized into four key areas. These are Create Elements, Create Macros, Fabricate, and Manage making it easier for users to find the tools that they need within the Power Pack. The GTCX file transfer in the Power Pack has new options to exchange information between Advanced Steel and Greytech software via the GTC GTCX import and export. This improves the exchange of information between Advanced Steel and Advanced Design. A new tool has been added to the Power Pack uh, called Check Parts. This command will find items in the model that don't have any features, notches, cuts, holes, etc. that don't require a fabrication detail. These items can be ordered straight from the bill of materials. As well as finding these items, a description of without drawing will be added to the user attributes for the items that the tool finds. One of the new tools that have been added to the 2021 Power Pack is the Kingspan SBS Mezzanine Floor Beam Systems Create CAM and CAM Data. This new tool is specific to the Kingspan SBS Mezzanine Floor Beam Systems and will allow users to create an export which can be sent straight to Kingspan SBS for manufacturing. The new CAM tool will produce the following items. A CAM file, a drawing required report, a warning report for non-standard details, an error log and a summary file. The reports, logs and summary file are all in notepad format. As well as the CAM data, a new drawing process for Kingspan SBS has been added to the system. To access this, simply open the drawing processes palette, click on the Union Jack flag and choose Greytech UK styles and then you will see the Kingspan SPS details button. A new Learn option has been added to the Power Pack. It's located at the end of the Power Pack. This Learn option gathers all the external information about the Power Pack, such as videos, news and FAQs, and social media activity. One of the new functions you will see in the Power Pack is the Stairs and Railings Vault. Formerly installed as a separate package called the BIM. BIM designers, stairs and railings, these tools are now being merged into the Power Pack. These stairs and railings tools will be available to users with a Power Pack Premium or Ultimate License. The Greytech Stairs tool allow you to model straight or balanced stairs with a 1, 2 or 3 flight configuration in U, L or Z shapes. These stair tools also allow users to create stairs with plate stringers. So we'll quickly demonstrate a two flight staircase. So we'll choose the two flight U. We'll then need to choose our setting out points. These setting out points are drawn on the floor so that defines the U and then we simply select the point to define the height. That will then create my two flight staircase with the landing, all made from plate stringers. I am using a library entry here, but I will just quickly go in and set the risers, the number of treads that I require in each flight. Uh, in this example, I need nine in each flight. And then the staircase will fall in line with all of my setting out points. For the 2021 release, the new stair functions include the ability to create treads from special parts, which are managed via the special part manager, the option to add nosing bars from profiles or folded profiles on treads and landings. On the stringers, we now have the ability to extend the inner stringers 
through to the outer stringers uh, so that we can support the landing. We also on the landing have the ability to add supporting ribs and we also have the ability to split the landing into the fabricatable pieces that we, we require. These landings can be split either on the extended stringers or the support ribs that we add into the macro. For the railings, the Greytech railing tool now allow you to model ball post, key clamp, double post, wall rail and standard railings. Users can also create infill panels from plates or gratings inside the key clamp, double post and standard railing tools. These panels can be connected to post with special part clamps or have a fabricated frame generated around the panel. The Greytech railing tools do not need a supporting beam and can be modelled based on AutoCAD lines or points chosen by the user. They can also be connected to beams, plates, gratings or nothing. We also have the ability to specify the post positions um, which means that we can create railings with unequal centres. Again we'll just demonstrate quickly the key clamp railing tool. So this is the option where we can set our own post positions. So we'll just click some random centres here. And that will create key clamp railings with random post centers or post centers to suit what we require as detailers. And those are the new functions within the Greytech 2021 Power Pack for Advanced Steel.